Now at five, people in Montgomery County are on edge as police investigate a string of home break-ins. Someone on the prowl was able to get into a woman's home while she was sleeping, and police think the person could be responsible for more crimes in that area. Friday night, Rick is off. John Paul is joining us. The big story on Action News is this warning from police. Yeah, these crimes happened just yesterday in Collegeville, and that's where Action News reporter Aliana Gomez is live for us with more on the action now being taken to try to keep people safe. Aliana? Well, John and Shari, police tell me that they do believe the same suspect or suspects are responsible for both crimes because they say they use the same stolen item for both break-ins. This normally quiet street just blocks away from Ursinus College is now at the center of a home invasion style burglary. It kind of makes me uncomfortable <laughs> that it's like that close to the school that we go to. And like we're walk it's like two girls walking alone at night too. I feel like people need to be aware like that this is going on. It happened overnight Thursday on 7th and Chestnut in Collegeville. A woman sleeping in her home woke up to find that someone gained access through a window and stole cash, credit cards, lawn equipment, and gasoline from the victim's generator. They stole a hose from one of the residents and it was used in both burglaries to siphon gas from two vehicles. Collegeville police say it's unusual for something like this to happen here, but no community is immune to crime. We always recommend that people close and lock their first floor windows at night. They lock their cars. Don't leave valuables inside your car, especially visible. As investigators process DNA from the home, they're urging people to check their surveillance cameras to see if it can help them track down the burglars. And police tell me they've stepped up patrols in the area, and they're also on the lookout for suspicious activity. Of course, if anybody sees anything suspicious, they're urged to call police. Reporting live in Collegeville, Aliana Gomez, Channel 6, Action News. Shari? All right, Aliana, thank you.